How you doing guys and welcome to a new video for those of you that are new to the channel. My name is Joshua Daniel George, I scale brands up to 7 figures by leveraging paid traffic and I also teach agencies on how to do the same. And as I already mentioned in the previous video on my YouTube channel that you know I was basically going to do a sort of day in the life vlog uh, here in Bali. Um, I've basically gone from the Netherlands to Bali and I just wanted to bring you guys along with me on my day and then I thought rather than actually doing a vlog which I haven't really done in a while and I didn't really want to do on this channel anymore I thought I'd just do a voiceover which is a bit more creative a bit more TikTok style uh, basically you know going through what I do on a regular day here with that said obviously every day is different um, especially now we know I'm exploring the islands I'm uh, sightseeing I'm doing different things on different days but on average uh, this is sort of the structure that I you know basically stick to so I usually get up around 5.30, uh, anywhere between 5.30 and 6 o'clock. The reason for that really was because that uh, when I you know, first got here, I was extremely jet lagged. I got up extremely early uh, just because my sort of, you know, body clock woke me up that early. And from that point onwards, I basically just stuck to that same routine because to be fair, it is you know, quite chilled. It's the sun rises, things anywhere between 5:30 and 6 here. So to get up around that time is extremely peaceful. You know, to look and see the sunrise, um, and to get work done at that point in the day where it's a bit cooler as well is uh, it's just extremely chilled, and you know, it makes for a good start of the day. So once we've woken up, at, like I said, around 5:30, usually I'll start my first deep work block at 6 a.m. And the way the time zone is different, usually I will get like the last few hours of. Uh, clients in Europe and then of course you know clients that are in the US are still usually awake so I can get you know a decent amount of work done in that first deep work block and usually I'll have that first deep work block on my balcony here as well the deep work block will usually last around an hour where I'll go through all of my clients accounts make sure everything is still profitable make sure that the back-end deals that I've set up are extremely profitable for me as well as the clients and then from that moment onwards basically i'll shut up my laptop and then i'll get ready to get a workout in luckily for me on this complex there is a gym so um i can basically you know close my laptop put on some gym gear and then go straight to the gym i'll get a workout in from let's say 7 to let's say 8 uh, a.m you know short workout no need for me to spend like two hours in the gym or anything like that so within an hour usually i will be done and then from there i will go and get breakfast so uh 8 a.m will be usually my breakfast time back in europe i usually fast till about 12 or 1 but to be fair i've actually enjoyed having an actual breakfast here in bali so um 8 a.m is when I sort of break my fast and have something to eat um, and then at 9 a.m what I'll do is I'll go to uh, Zing Cafe here in Changu um, and then I'll get another deep work block in but then just different surroundings basically in a co-working space and then from 10 o'clock onwards um, basically from that point onwards because of the time zone difference I'll just go and explore the island because there's nothing left for me to do no client is awake between 10 a.m. and 4 p.m. my time so it's basically just complete freedom uh, I can do whatever I want go sightseeing and then on this particular day we actually went to Ubud we went to the monkey forest um, we went to the rice terraces as well explored that you know seen what that was like uh, checked out the monkeys um, and then from that point we drove all the way back um, and then we got back around around 4 p.m. which is actually perfect because that is when uh, the team in Europe wake up so 4 p.m. Bali time is 9 a.m. Uh, Amsterdam time Netherlands and then it's 8 a.m. Uh, UK time so that is when we have like we usually have the morning check-in so because I'm not taking any calls here in Bali I will send my sort of check-in notes uh, via text to the team then from there we sort of all know what needs doing what needs picking up what we can uh, you know focus on for the remainder of the day and then between 4 p.m. and 5 p.m. I'll get one more deep work block in and that is sort of me done then for the rest of the day so as you can see when I structure my day it's focused on the clients it's focused on the time zone difference but all in all it's just three deep work blocks where i am extremely productive and then the rest of the time i'm basically just chilling and i'm exploring you know basically the island um so between four and five is my last deep work block of the day and then from that point onwards it's get something to eat um and then basically you know, chill for the remainder of the evening so like i said you know every day is different here in Bali uh, we're doing a lot of exploring you know a lot of seeing what's going on on the island a lot of 
um, you know, looking at like the spots that you sort of need to go to every time you're in Bali, or you know, if it's your first time Bali, you know, sort of must see locations. Um, but all in all, you know, it's quite a simple routine, nice and structured. Um, I'm still getting a lot of work done, which obviously, you know, with my ANC is something that I like to focus on because of the back-end deals that we set up for our clients, which basically means that if our client makes a lot of money, we make a lot of money as well, and that is um, how we've structured our agency. But anyway, that is it for today's video. If you wanna know more about uh, what I'm doing in Bali, or if you wanna see more vlogs of Bali, just let me know in the comments below. Like this video if you got something out of it, subscribe to the channel for more, and I'll see you all in the next video.